All right, thought I'd show you some quick pics or a little movie of the PC that I built. And this is the big dog right here. My mechanical keyboard, Corsair M95 gaming keyboard. Corsair M95, oh, I guess the light's not working so hot. And so is the, the focus. But that's my Corsair M95 gaming mouse. Um, RTS, 14 programmable keys on it. Um, HD gaming monitor from Asus. Beast of a all-in-one printer and all that fun stuff. Specialized scanner for my wife for doing um, M or uh, 45 mil slides. There's actually two scanners. There's a scanner in the bed, and then there's a regular scanner in there. And then she puts all her slides in there from the from her old family albums. And then it creates high definition photos. Of course, every every wife has to have a cricket. But uh, here's the beast. Um, there's my two terabyte backup drive that sits back there that I just use as a regular drive. There's the front with the. Uh, Additional stuff, on-off switch, additional USB, audio, mic, all that fun stuff. CD drive, and of course a card reader with additional USB on it. Um, I leave this metal plate off because I've got lighted fans in there. Of course, when I want to turn everything on, let's see if I can do this in both. You just click the mouse, and voila. Everything comes on. So this is everything powering up. The monitor's set up to power up when the computer comes on. So one click of the mouse turns everything on in one one shot, which is really cool. And then everything's lighting up, booting up. As I add more software, I real I'm beginning to see that it takes a little bit longer for the uh, computer to boot up. It used to take only five seconds. Now it takes about ten seconds to boot up, which still I don't think is quite all that bad. It should actually go any second now because it's uh, been showing everything. And there it goes asking for my password. So that's how long that takes. three fans in the front and a push pull and of course there's three fans in the back and that's for the drives I've got two big fans on, on this side I've got two fans on the other side normally there's three fans sitting up here I have one out right now and then underneath the radiator I have two more and then of course I have one going out the back for exhaust there's my graphics card there's my RAM on both sides of my CPU which is underneath that pump right there and then of course you see the water going up into the radiator and then down below I have the rat's nest and I don't know if you can see I guess it's kind of hard to see but there's a module down there with that yellow light there right in the middle of the screen and that is how I monitor everything on my monitor. I can take the RPMs of everything and the temperatures of everything. But yeah, I thought I'd uh, show you real quick, real quick, since you're interested, just exactly what's going on here with what I built. Notice how even the individual RAM modules have their own lights. And then you can't tell. Well, you can't see, but there's light bars that light up everything that are tension, uh, temperature sensitive so as that CPU warms up those light bars will change colors will go from green to blue to red which is really neat um, again I don't know if I said it but that's my two terabyte supposedly backup drive that's now just a drive because I'm not going to pay them $75 to download the software it's stupid but then We'll come over here, we'll click into here, we'll do the super secret password. That'll load up. 
and as this is loaded up, loading up, it's going to go into my Corsair link. And of course, you have all the different steam and stuff. But here's how I monitor everything. All those will come live. That red pump. As soon as I find where my mouse is, actually goes over here, and this one comes down here. But as you can see, right here, I'm using 1.65.94.48 of my processor. That hardly ever goes up above anything. These are all temperatures. This is my pump RPM. These are RPMs of the two of the fans above. These are all fans. The two fans on my graphics card. The uh, temperature of my Samsung 850 Pro SSD. Um, but yeah, this is how I monitor everything. And then of course it's just you know. Welcome to Windows 8.1, soon to be Windows 10.0. But, uh, yeah. The computer Paul built. I'm proud of it. It's the first computer I ever built. It's really cool. Especially if I back up. And we go dark. And then it's really, really cool. But, uh, yeah, I like it. The performance is awesome. The keyboard lights up, which is nice when you're playing in the dark. The mouse lights up. Of course, the monitor lights up. But, uh, yeah, pretty cool. Pretty fun to goof around with and play with. Um, I don't do near as much gaming on it as well. I thought I would because I end up doing more benchmarking to see what I can do and how I can tweak it and this and that and the other and all that fun stuff. But, yeah. Pretty neat. I might even post this on YouTube real fast on my channel. Pretty cool. Later. See you uh, later on today in a couple hours.